one of the things that I want to do purposefully in 2024 is, is reach out to my network, people that I know, respect, and many of them are on this channel with me. And I want to ask them one question. Who, other than family, right? Mom, wife, all of that doesn't count. But who external to you has had the most positive impact on your life? And we're going to start with the one and only T-Y-L-G. Ty, you've been with me a long time, family. What's going on? So who is it for you? Oh, this is a no-brainer. It's the one and only Mr. Tony Robbins. <laughs> I love that. Wow, look at that book. He He's a baby in that book. This I picked this book up, I want to say, like, maybe 91 1990, 91, something like that. I think it was published wow. in, I want to say it was published in like 88 or 87, 89, somewhere in that range. Yeah. And I'm literally, I'm a gardener. I'm doing landscape work. I want more out of my life. I'm figuring out, okay, how am I going to, you know, what's next? And I'm doing a yard for a guy. I've told this story before, I think, on the show. And the guy's like 25 years old. I'm like 19 and I'm like, how are you so successful? You got this beautiful house and a new Corvette, and a new truck. What do you do? And he's like, I buy and sell real estate. I'm a contractor, but I buy, I buy. He actually said, I buy and hold real estate. I buy rentals. And of course I flip a little bit. And he brings me into his home and he says, there's two or three books you need to buy. Do you read books? And I'm saying, uh, not really. He goes, you need to go buy this book, Tony Robbins. Awaken the Giant. And then, of course, he recommended also Robert Allen. But I'll tell you that this book, and I was lucky that in sequence, this book was the book that basically gave me the fundamentals of you can do anything you want. You set goals, you know, measure, you know, smart goals, right? You know, specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, timelines, all of that. But it was this book, man. And then not only that, the psychology of, you know, you've got to engage your physiology. You've got to change yeah. your self-talk, your self-beliefs, your limiting, what's holding you back, your limiting beliefs. So it was this book, man, that was the very beginning for, for me. This is where it all started. So, you know, I, I love the fact that there's a couple of things. Clearly that book has been read a lot. It's been worn, right? It's not like pristine. You, you have post-it notes probably on important chapters or things that you go back and revisit. And it is such an old book. He ain't Tony Robbins. He is Anthony Robbins. <laughs> That's right. This was the kid. This was the, yeah, this was like young Tony when he caught, he parted his hair to look uh, older. Yeah. He did the, yeah. the like parted it and had it a little bit longer and wore suits. This was actually too, even yeah. all of his seminars, everything. He wore suits because just to look more mature. So he could look like he was 35 when he was 27 or 28 or whatever he was. This is the okay. OG Tony. So all right, so let's go on this journey with the audience. So you're 19-year-old, you're a gardener. Somebody you interact with says, buy the book. You buy the book, you read it. And that begins your, your what would be, a 30-year journey with Tony Robbins. So I'm guessing not only one book, but you've read many, and you've probably been to a few events, I'm guessing. I've been to more than, I would say more than 30 events with Tony over the last um, uh, over the last 30 years, more than 30 live events. Um, wow. Yeah. So like yeah. there was a time when Tony, this was back in the nineties. This was interesting because now, um, maybe he does, uh, four to six live events per year and now right. he does virtual so he can leverage that. And that's been amazing. But I will say that like, um, in the old days he would go LA, San Jose, San Francisco, Seattle. Then he would go like uh, Salt Lake City, Denver. And it was like basically almost every month or every six weeks, he was somewhere. And then he'd do the East Coast back and forth. He lived in San Diego back then. So he did a lot of West Coast stuff. So like he would do one day sales events and that could be like every six weeks in a different city. And then he would also do the uh, three day weekend, four day weekend, the uh, Firewalk weekend, Unleash the Power Within. So he was doing those a lot more frequently. And um, and then also this was the beauty is after I attended, I got invited back to be a volunteer, a staff. They called it staffing back then. They wow. call it crew today. So I got to go for free 
And then I got to see behind the scenes. I got to see Tony run a meeting with his trainers. I got to help run microphones. I was a mic runner. I got to see all the inner working. So we would get there a day early and it was just amazing. And like, it was a time like no other. It was um, absolutely amazing. The amount of exposure to be blessed, to be around Tony in such a way. So, yeah. So we'll, we'll get into those uh, one-on-one. Actually, we're going to go there first. Yeah. I'm guessing over 30 years, you've actually had the chance to meet the man, interact with him personally. You're not just, you know, arm's length away. All the way, all the way. And it was beautiful because there's a gal, uh, Lauren, who back then, she's still involved. She actually is like one of the stage speakers. She teaches, I think, at Wealth Mastery now. But Lauren actually ran the staff. Now they call it crewing. Um, back then, she ran it. So there were times where even, hey, Tony's going to do a private event for, um, it was one of the Silicon Valley, I, I want to say Cisco, or it was one of the, um, one of the tech manufacturers, companies. tech companies. Yeah. And he would do it one day and they'd be like, hey, can you come and support the room? And so we would be like in the back of the room, yeah. a t-shirt, whatever. And we would just answer questions, get somebody a pin if they need if they lost their workbook, yeah. whatever the case may be. But um, get, getting behind the scenes and being with Tony at such a level was absolutely amazing. And not only that, but you got to see, this is somebody, Tony is somebody who walks the walk, talks the talk, walks the walk, and then even beyond. You would see his like commitment to want to over deliver and make sure that the room's right. Make sure that the music, the playlist, that the energy, the, just the presence of the chairs, making sure that people had like snacks and, you know, like during the breaks and such, like just making sure that everything was ran exactly right. And that the people in his care were taken care of that. He wanted to always over deliver way over deliver. So that's awesome. So let's go back to the 30 plus events over 30 years. Why? Aren't they all the same? Yes, I would say yes, but also consider that um, tuning, right? Like tuning a piano, tuning an instrument, right? Or even I love the, uh, you know, sharpening the ax, right? If you had to go out and chop wood, right? A lot of people would say, if you had eight hours to chop the wood, some people say, hey, you might spend an hour, 45 minutes sharpening the ax. And then maybe after lunch, you might want to spend another half hour sharpening the ax, right? So that you can right. have a better chop. So it's the same thing in life. It's like that retuning. Plus you're always a different person. You're in a different yes. level, right? And they say new level, new devils, right? So yeah, you true. have new challenges, things that you're trying to work through, things, you know, family and life and business. And I would say that um, just, you know, the idea that psychology, and that's really Tony's like, he's like the psychology, the meaning, things happen. And like a lot of times, like this is one of my favorite Tonyisms is life is happening for me, not mm. to me, right? So the idea wow. is I had, I don't know that I've heard that before. Yeah. And if I have, if I have, I, it didn't hit until you kind of put it that way. Um. That's a, that's a, that's a mind twister right there. That, you know, there's challenges and things. And it's like, you got to look at these challenges as opportunities. And so right. Tony, like no other man, I got to say, um, world-class world, world-class and, um, like no other, like just the idea of full immersion. So like when I met you, this is, mm -hmm. this is cool. So I met you and I instantly said, that guy's doing things at a high level and they, they teach modeling. I'm like, this guy's really smart, not just real estate investor smart, but like financial smart. You, when I met you, I'm like, I need to be in that guy's world. So what did I do? I said, okay, how do I get around Michael? How can I spend more time? Okay, I know. How can I bring value? How can we do a show together? How can I help him? What can I, just so that I could be around you because I want to learn, how do you think? How do you look at markets? How do you, that's what Tony teaches and called modeling. The idea is that you have recipes and formulas and it's like, okay, how do I model what Michael Zuber does? That's what people, when they're watching the show, they should be watching to learn yeah. how to model the way you think. Yeah. The other thing I want to applaud Tony for, and, and kind of joking aside about, hey, all 30 events are the same. The, the power in that is Tony's not chasing some get rich quick, some moment terry like he's not he's not trend following he's like i've been doing this you know for a you know a thousand ten thousand days i've helped millions of people i've helped feed billions of i mean he he's refined his 
you know, I'm sure he's refined. I'm sure he's twisted with, with, you know, the decades that have gone by, but he is who he is all the way back from that book where he was Anthony Robbins, right. Awaken the giant. Essentially what he's been sharing is the same thing. And that's a good thing, not a bad thing. 100%. 100%. And I'll say too, that even though the, the foundational, and I love this, the principles of what he teaches and unleash the power within or business mastery or date with destiny, which are all different, right? Different focuses and all of the stuff that he teaches, the principles and the foundation stays the same, yeah. right? It's about inside who, how you're showing up, your being, your, you know, your self-talk, your, your physiology, you know, all the things like about you, but then also he does add in the nuances of, what's going on in social media, what's going on in the United States culturally. He actually yeah. brings those things and integrates those into, into the conversation of transformation, of optimization yeah. and all of it. And then I want to say too, just one other thing that's so beautiful. Like I can remember being at a, he originally did a time management seminar. You can find it on YouTube. It's out there, pieces of it. Uh, he called it OPA outcome, purpose, massive action. He then rebranded it and called it RPM because RPM, like an automobile yeah, results, purpose, massive action. But in there, I can remember he laid out this blueprint of how he was going to transform his financial business world. And he had not done this yet. He was still very much 90% was speaking uh, the product, the, the the information product, the CDs and cassettes and such. Mm -hmm. That was pretty much his, his, all of his income was revolved around the speaking and coaching and such. He had this business plan and he wrote it out and he showed everybody. It's like, I'm going to get little pieces of companies by going in and working with the C-suite, working with the CEOs, CFOs, whatever, and get a piece of equity for exchange yeah. and coaching. And of course, what does he do now? Now he owns like 150 plus or minus companies. His net worth is like, I don't, I don't really know exactly, but I would say six, seven, eight, maybe he's a billionaire. I don't really know if he isn't, he will be. And he's very close. He's in the hundreds of millions of dollars. I would think so. Yeah. Hundreds. He yeah, executed sure. all of that over the last 15, 20 years. And it was yeah. literally, and he laid it out and it's like, this is what I'm going to do. And so yeah. the clarity and purpose and the way that this man works and the way that he's able to share it and teach it like no other. Yeah, the other thing uh, I didn't know we were going to talk about Tony Robbins. I didn't know who you were going to, who you were going to answer. But uh, I actually saw a Tony Robbins ad on one of the YouTube videos, and I watched it. Right, it's like three or five minutes or something. And I think he's on to something. I think the next five years are going to happen no matter what. I think they're going to be tough for a lot of people. A sideways market is not up and to the right where it's easy to make money. It's going to be a slog. It's going to be difficult. And I think. I know I should say that I know the mindset that you carry with you, you're going to be able to attack it and take advantage or it's going to crush you. Um, I think there's a lot of things Tony Robbins can offer folks. He's doing a lot more stuff virtually now, so you don't have to get on airplanes. What are, what are some, I mean, do you have your next Tony Robbins thing already planned or do you know the next ones that are coming or what, where should somebody start? Maybe is a better question. Um, the best I think is the UPW unleash the power within, and that is a virtual event. You can buy it. It's, it's a few hundred, but it's like four or 500 bucks. Maybe And I'll just stop you there. That's actually the thing that you gifted me in 2020. I Correct. think it was, uh, and I, I watched the whole thing. I thought it was a lot of, a, a lot of, a lot of fun. I mean, I, he, the energy that he could put through this to thousands of people, it was, it was very impressive. So you, so UPW is where to start. UPW is where to start. And um, what's great about that is that it's, and like you said, you said something fun. He incorporates yeah. fun into yeah. the learning. And that's a big deal. And what he teaches too, a lot of it is that you have to engage your physiology. The more that you can get your body moving, have fun, be playful, have music, the environment, the just whether it's work or exercising or a seminar, an event, it's just going to be at a deeper level. And so the UPW, I believe he's got them coming up. I'm looking at the calendar. He's got one in March. I think the third week of March, I believe around the 21st. So uh, March 21st, it's virtual. Um, he just this last week completed a business mastery, which is a great one. He does two of those a year. Next one is in August. Um, but I think everybody, even if you said, 
I really want to learn about business from Tony. The UPW is great because it helps you retune you. Yeah. It helps yeah. you retune and this. Which, there's so much stuff going on now. We're just pounded with things. I think that tuning, calibrating, I think it's, and I think you've been wise to go back because you're right. You're also at a different level, right? You're now, you know, you have a father, a business. You're not a single guy anymore. That's just, you know, a gardener. Uh, yeah. That's pretty powerful. Yeah. yeah. And it's, and it's really about having like showing up as, like you said, the different roles or identities, right? Being a great husband, being a great father, being a great, you know, leader within a business, within a community. And it's what you do. And, and, you know, and it's interesting, we all have, the things we do really well at, but we also have those things that maybe it's like, ah, I want a little more here. Yeah. Yeah. Me too. I get it. I love it. Uh, That's Ty, what Tony helps to identify. Ty, you're amazing. You are a huge part of my universe, my world. You'll be at the Vegas event. I can't wait for more and more people to meet you. Um, where can people find you? Very simple. They can go to tylg.com. They can email if you have questions, if I can be helpful, ty at tylg.com. You email me. Um, I have a free course for realtors, creative financing. I give that away free. I originally developed it for the hub and for the Fresno community. So as a part of Michael's community, I give it away for free. You just email me ty at tylg.com. And I want to say there's oh. another guy. Right here, like you want to make your life better, go and buy the One Rental at a Time book, buy the Tony Robbins book, get to a Tony Robbins event. Also, yeah. you can get yourself to a virtual yeah. Michael Zuber event. He's selling tickets. There's limited amount. You can go to one rental at a time.com. How much is the virtual event, Michael? 99 bucks and you get the video after so you can watch it whenever you want. Value, folks. Value. That's what Michael's adding here. Buy the course. Come be with us for two days, virtually. February President's Day weekend. It's about yep. a month away, right? Almost. A yeah, seventeenth and eighteenth. I go to the event tomorrow. The event center tomorrow to plan out, make sure everything's set up, ready to rock and roll. So it's it's right around the corner. It's it's getting serious now. You know what's great, Michael? And I found this too when I I wanted to say, folks, ah, there's no more. You don't have to do it the hard way. I used to take this to my W two. <laughs> Yeah. With headphones. This, yep. some of you don't know, this is a cassette recorder. <laughs> They're like, what is that? This is a cassette recorder. This is the original, uh, you know, the yeah. OG. This was the original iPhone before. Yep. Right. But I'm saying like, this is what we had to do today. We have the world at our fingertips. Get yourself yeah. to the virtual event. You can literally on your smartphone, Just plug they could in, even, yeah. they could even attend this, the, the, they could listen in via. Yeah, absolutely. On your smart device. So anyway, yeah. folks, get yourself to the virtual event. Michael, thank you for all that you do. I'm sorry. I'll let you close it out. I'm apologizing. No, hey, you're the man. Uh, Tony Robbins, more people should follow. Check him out. Uh, watch some of his YouTube content. Pretty amazing. Thank you, brother.